We have uh, started our first uh, test in the Envir environmental test campaign, uh, which is the thermal balance thermal vacuum test, and the program is going as planned. That means uh, we are now at 60 and we will start pumping down, okay? Right. Okay. Guys, pumping down is starting now. Now? Now. The test is divided in three phases. We have a first phase which we call thermal balance, a second phase which we call thermal vacuum, and the last phase, which we call Venus hot phase. This is a vertical integration stand. We are preparing this stand for the next transport of the spacecraft. We are clarifying the way to the chamber. We have to go through several clean rooms to get there. And it's quite interesting all the time and very dynamic and a lot of people you have to deal with. My name is Aret Schnork and my function in the JUICE project is that I'm the manager of the assembly, integration and testing of the spacecraft and also of the launcher interface. We will bring the spacecraft into this big chamber and then uh, we will close it and nobody will see it anymore. Uh, we will do a long test which is lasting uh, months and the main objective is to verify that the thermal subsystem of the spacecraft is operating fine like it will be in space. This is a quite sensitive operation because you have to come close to get access to the, to the instruments. Okay, but yes, finally we are successful. So I guess uh, it will be in the next hour we finalize all the preparations and uh, we can close the chamber. was the, the quality representative for Airbus and uh, we were yesterday closing both, uh, both doors of the chamber, first the upper one, then the five meters front door. So yeah, I was uh, the last one to see Jus before we see it again a few weeks after its first trip to space. <laughs> so, so no, it was, it was something very nice to do and also to see it finally in the configuration, no scaffolding, everything open, no retta high jumps, everything looking as close as possible to how it's going to look when it's traveling to Jupiter. So, really, so nice experience. It's the pressure going down in the chamber from one bar, so we will go to one 10 to the minus 5 millibar. Uh, in space is real vacuum, it's even lower than that. But normally one 10 to the minus 5 is, is good enough to start. Uh. Good luck with the test. And here we are for everything. So thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, see you. Almost at the end of the test we will uh, rotate uh, the spacecraft and switch on the sun of the LSS, mm -hmm. which uh, is uh, also a very nice moment. Uh, we have seen it already in the dry run, uh, but of course with much less intensity and, uh, that we will uh, occur during the, during the test itself, uh, that we will go up to, I don't know, 3,400 watt per square meter, which is really a lot of uh, heat, <laughs> simulating the sun. Hehehe <laughs>